Good morning, Jake Paulers. Okay, so today we're going to talk about this new game called CryptoKitties. It is a game. It's built on the blockchain, and it's the first major real-world application of the blockchain we're seeing. <coughs> so, CryptoKitties is basically analogous to almost Bitcoin or any cryptocurrency. It's a more tangible, for the average man at least, cryptocurrency um, and it's uh, giving us a good example of how the blockchain can be used and it's uh, allowing us to see whether Ethereum can handle such high uses. The reason this game has gained popularity is that uh, over one million dollars worth of Bitcoin was uh, spent during the first day after launching and it's giving us a good example of whether the Ethereum network can handle such volumes while it's not being, while the consequences of it failing would not be so far reaching. Uh, yeah, so let's get started. Um, we go to CryptoKitties.co, try to sign in, and it requests us to install MetaMask. So I'll go ahead and do that. Oh, of course, I do have it installed already, but uh, if you don't, just uh, install it through Chrome. It'll be a Chrome extension, and I'll take you back to my. Okay. So once you have it installed, you have your MetaMask signed in, which is there. And yeah, these are a list of transactions I've done on MetaMask. Of course, you'll need to fund your MetaMask account, which can simply be done by copying the address to your clipboard and inputting that into your wallet where you currently hold your Ether. <coughs> so the first thing you're going to want to do is buy a cat or a couple of kittens. Uh, let's look at this one for example. Hi, my name is Kitty number 148360. Uh, we get the bio of the cat, the cat attributes, where the cat's parents are. So, we notice something here, Gen 5. These are all Gen 5 cats. Gen 5 means it's the fifth generation. Uh, when the game was started, all kittens were Gen 0, and all breeding after that increased the generations. Uh, kittens are valued much higher to be lower generations. Uh, last night I've already seen kittens at like generation 20 costing something like 0 0.01 ether versus generation 0 costing something like 200 ether. Uh, also we see this linear, uh, linearly decreasing graph. Uh, as the sale starts we have the price of the kitten there uh, decreasing depending on the time that the seller sets to a also predetermined price. Um, we could buy this kitten and okay, buy this kitty. Of course, I don't have enough. Oh, looks like someone else bought this kitty. That tends to happen a lot because of the Ethereum uh, processing time and of course you being not fast enough. Let's try buying another kitty. Here's a generation one kitty for 31 ether which is something like $15,000 $15,000 now of course I don't have enough ether in my wallet so I would have to reject it but otherwise you could simply just purchase the kitty. Let's go back to the marketplace. We also have siren kitties. So these are kitties that are available for hire uh, to impregnate your kitty or you could sire your kitty to be a father to uh, someone else's kitten mother. 
Um, you could also say a kit is between themselves. So, for example, uh, my Gen 4 and Gen 6 gave birth to a Gen 7. Um, I cannot, however, in, um, let a father impregnate his daughter. Uh, so we've, we're glad to know that uh, CryptoKit is, isn't promoting too much in breeding. Um, another thing to notice is the cooldown period. This is how fast uh, a kitty can uh, breed again. Uh, this also increases the price uh, depending how quick it can cool down, with fast being the most desired and catatonic being the least desired. Um, if you want to breed your kitties, that's simple. So this is how I could say it to the public, a start price, end price, and for how long I'd like it. And this is with one of my other kitties. I'd like to give them some privacy. But again, this costs ether, and I do not have enough. Yeah, so I'll reject all of it, and yeah, I can see a lot of rejected transactions. Oh, okay, and that is basically the entire Ether Crypto Kitties game. Of course, this kitty that I did breed, I could probably sell for about 0.5 Ether, which is giving me something like a 33% return in about 30 minutes uh, so I don't know if people are playing it for the fun of it or the novelty or just to make money but uh, it is still early days it only came out uh, about a week ago so yeah check it out